Introducing A Night to Change Your Life, featuring Dr. Willie Jolly, the number one inspirational, motivational speaker, singer in the world today. So today I'm going to be your tour guide on how to live the American dream, because it's still alive. In that moment, everything shifted in my head. If an 88-year-old man could have the optimism to believe that his best days were in front of him and not behind him, what did I have to whine and cry and complain about? And I went home with a new attitude. And I got on that phone and started making sales calls. And if people say no, I'd say next. They say, I'm not interested in what you got. And hang up in my face, I say, thank you, you're not the right one. Well, 25 years have gone by. I've been inducted in the Speaker Hall of Fame. I've been named one of the top five speakers in the world. I got best selling books, television and radio, but it's just the tip of the iceberg of what yet to come. But I came here tonight to say to you on this weekend, without a question in my mind, your best is yet to come. Your best is yet to come. Your best is yet to come. This is your moment. This is your day. This is your time to live your dream. To dream. Impossible dream. And my son was about six or seven years old at that point. He said, Daddy, isn't that where you used to work? I said, Yes, it is. He said, Daddy, did you get fired? I said, No, son, I quit. And when I said I quit, the the tears welled up in his eyes. I said, what's wrong? He said, Daddy, you told me never to quit, never give up. You just told me you quit. And I realized this was a place for a life lesson. I pulled the car over, and I took out my handkerchief. And I said, son, let me give you a life lesson here. I quit not because I was giving up. I quit because I was going up. I pray that the sun will always be at your face. The wind will always be at your back. And that God will keep you in the palm of his hand. And every day will be a sunny day for you. still there. Oh, thank God. Thank God. A lady said, how you doing, sir? I said, fantastic. Thank you. She said, fantastic. That's the first fantastic I've had all day. You must have had a really good day. I said, let me tell you what happened to me today. I, I was on my way. My car died. It started smoking. I had to roll down the window. I had to get to the car. The car didn't get the car. The guy got it. And she said, but you said fantastic. How you say you're fantastic without thinking? I said, ma'am. My circumstances do not determine my attitude. (laughs) Woo! She said, woo, I like that. You done turned me on today. She said, just for that, I'm bumping you up to first class. 
Oh, I thought he was sensational. The man is amazing. Willie was awesome. How about George Burns? He was 99 years old and had the nerve to sign a 10-year contract with Caesars Palace. <laughs> he said he would have signed a 20-year contract, but he didn't think they'd be in business. Oh, this is a moment. Forget all the odds. This day or never, we'll sit forever with our God. When we look back, well, we'll recall the moment for moment. This is a moment.